Welcome everyone. Our guest today is Melissa Marshall. Um, <laughs> does anyone know where we are? Have you been here before? <laughs> You're way better at that than me. We are at Dazzling Diva, whoop, whoop. which is a pole fitness studio. Yes, pole and aerial fitness. Yes, yeah, aer aerial. Yep. Yes. I'm, I'm a little scared for that. You should give it a go because I'll tell you the uh, the clients that do it and the instructors that do it love it. I see all the photos. So if you're not following them on Facebook and everything, first go do that right now. But we're going to talk about what Dazzling Diva is, how you became the business owner, how long you've been doing this. You oh will not goodness. believe. Um, so we're going to do a quick video, and we also have a podcast session that we're going to tape afterwards. So we're going to dive deep on there. The deep dive. The deep dive. Um, but Melissa's going to show us how to do one or two things, just so you get an idea. So first of all, how long have you been doing pole fitness? Oh, wow. Okay. So I became a client at Dazzling Diva Fitness when it originally opened under the original owners and it was either late 2008 or early 2009. So almost wow. what? 13, 14 13. years. Yeah. 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 Either That's incredible. Yeah. Either 13 or 14. Yeah. And to keep it's with been so long that I can't remember. <laughs> <laughs> and to keep with a fitness routine that long, yes. like it has to be amazing. It is. This, this yeah. is one of only two fitness related activities that I have ever stuck to for any length of time. The other is yoga. So yeah, it's, um, you know, in addition to being an amazing workout, which it absolutely is, um, it's just a lot of fun. And for me, fitness can be fun and should be fun. And it doesn't have to be a chore or something that you dread or that exactly. you do because you have to do it. Yeah. I've always been motivated to come here because I love it so much and I have such a great time. I don't want to say you forget that you're working out, but... <laughs> you definitely feel it. Yeah. It's about as much fun as working out can possibly be. So if yeah. you, um, you know, if you haven't tried it, I would certainly encourage everyone to give it a go because you just might be surprised. You really will. And so I wanted to try it forever, honestly, before the, when the last owner owned it. And I actually did sign up and then we had a giant snowstorm, so I didn't get yeah. here. And then yeah. we became friends yes. and you took over and I was like, okay, let's do this. That was kismet. It really was. <laughs> yes. For a lot of reasons. Yes. Um, <laughs> but that's one of the reasons that I wanted to feature you on here because A, you're so passionate about it and you have so much knowledge and you literally make everyone feel amazing when oh they come goodness. in and all of Thank the you. students make you feel amazing. That is true. It is a, a, a real community here. And I yeah. think that's another thing that has kept me so in love with this for so many years is that it's an amazing workout. It's a ton of fun and it really is a community. It's, you know, when you come in here, People know you, people are excited to see you, they expect they're, to see they're you. They're literally like, oh my gosh, show me your moves. Yes, like, yes. Literally. You are, I mean, you are so right when you say that it really is as supportive an environment as you can imagine. And I think, you know, genuinely, when one diva accomplishes something, everyone else is just it. as excited for them as yeah. they are for themselves. So it's, yeah. you know, it's not, it's not like an anonymous fitness experience where, you know, nobody's going to know if you came or not. You walk in, nobody speaks to you. Right. It's, but you also don't feel like you're competing. Not at all. Like, it's not like that at mm. all. And even people who have been doing it for years come to the beginner classes because it's so good for rebuilding everything. Yes. And so the thing I was worried about, I got these spindly little arms. Not <laughs> at all. Okay. Listen. And no, like most She's women, got moves. I have no upper body strength and I was very worried. Um, but I think within the first month I climbed a little bit. Yeah. And that was like, I did not think that was going to happen. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it happens quickly if you're worried, you know, and you're, you're not going to be good, yourself. but yeah. So yeah. I, yeah. So I think that's a very, um, <laughs> we're going to keep like glowing it, about it. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you know, I can't help it. I feel like a fool every time I talk about it because I'm just like, it, it probably amazing. seems like I'm faking it, but I'm really not. I am genuinely still this excited about it after all these years. But that is a common objection um, or barrier, I guess, to people starting right. is they, they think they don't that, you know, I yeah. don't have any upper body strength. I'm not already in shape, you know, some variation on that. And sure. that is there are many reasons to start a program like this. That is That's one of them. One. That's Absolutely. a You know, everybody has to start somewhere. And if your goal is to get stronger, if your goal is to get in better shape. You gotta start. You just gotta yeah. start. And listen, I don't want to do push-ups. I don't want to do right. You know, hang things that you have to do push-ups. 
<laughs> I wasn't gonna tell you guys what you find that one yeah, out. Right. Um, there's one other move I don't like too, but I won't say it. And the beauty of it is you'll be strong enough to do those push-ups. Exactly. You, you come and you stick with it, you will be strong enough to do those push-ups quicker than you think. Yeah, for sure, mm -hmm. for sure. Okay, so Melissa's gonna show us one or two moves. Ooh, and la la la. We'll see how I do compared to Melissa. You're gonna do great. You're gonna <laughs> I do haven't great. been in a while, so. That's okay, the muscle memory is probably still I, there. I hope so, it's mm -hmm. gonna be interesting. Mm -hmm. I tried to convince, because none of the other team members could come at this time that we're taping right now, I tried to convince my husband to come, because we are supposed to do a private class oh, yes. with you. Yes, we just you haven't are. had time to schedule. Um, he's like, yeah, I'm not in that frame of mind right now. Uh, so it's just me embarrassing myself today. So that's okay. I'm doing it for you guys. Um, <laughs> Listen, we all embarrass ourselves at some point, but that's the beauty of it. Like, yeah, you know, nobody is good at all the things. And no one's watching you it's when true. You're, they're doing it. Right. And there's a saying, do your other side. Right. Oh, 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 it's a whole thing. Yeah. So you have it, to do everything <laughs> you know, each way. Yep, yep. And it's definitely a mental thing too. It's not just a workout. Like you are thinking and kind of retraining your brain and how your body moves. So Absolutely. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So let's see the fun what part. we're going to do. <laughs> so let's, let's make our, our stand up fancy. Uh, straighten out your left leg, cross your right leg over, uh -huh. tuck your left foot under, place your hands on your left thigh and twist around to a pop up. Now trace it up. Nice. See, we can Did make, enjoy that? We can make <laughs> looking up get good too. <laughs> We're gonna switch the camera around and show you a, a much better move with hopefully a better view. <laughs> All right, one of the very first moves we teach is called the half spin to a stop. So I'm demonstrating that. Walking right, so that means my right hand is on the inside, it's up nice and high. And when we walk around our pole, we don't just walk upright like la la la. We lean out and make it a little fancier. Okay, so here's your calf spin. You're gonna plant the inside foot, extend the outside foot. You're gonna draw a big, big circle around your pole with your outside toes, and you're not going to pick up the inside foot at all. Okay, now when I get around, when my outside foot gets around to where my inside foot is, I'm going to plant the outside foot and bring the inside foot up and hook the pole. Okay, so this is starting, this is ending. All right, here we go. We're gonna walk into it. I'm planting, extending, draw a big, big circle, plant, switch. Okay. You got this. I think I got this. <laughs> Take it away, Missy. Guys, seriously, this is kind of embarrassing. We, we normally don't have people watching us, like I said, no one watching us. So, here I am. Would you have a lot? Good, good. Yeah, good, good. Go, Missy. When you're ready, plant your inside foot, extend the outside. There it is, there it is, there it is. Switch. Woo! <laughs> you did great, as I knew you would. Now, it back pretty quickly. Yes, it really does. Now, do you want to try it on the other side? Yes. <laughs> okay. Okay, so same thing. same thing. Inside hand is on top, up high. Inside foot is going to plant, outside foot is going to extend, draw a big, big circle, swing it around, plant, and switch. Okay. You got this. Which is, so, if you know me, you know I'm left-handed, but I do everything with my right hand other than right, so this is going to look awful. <laughs> it is not. You probably do better than you think. Oh, yeah. Nice. The walk looks good. The walk looks good. Now, Woo! Spin the outside leg, right? You're gonna plant the inside, extend and spin with the outside. Yes, yes! Woo! <laughs> Rock star! Okay, I think we need to do a fireman's a spin. That's exactly what like I was thinking. Okay, so guys. We're definitely on the same page. So, another beginner spin that you will learn fairly on in your pole journey is the fireman's spin, and of course, this is the one that most people associate with. Oh. Yeah, you know, coming down the pole in the firehouse. So the good news is a lot of what we do in here, if not everything we do in here, builds upon something that you learned before. So it's very similar to our half spin in that the inside foot is planted, inside hand is up nice and high, outside leg is extended. But this time we're going to be bringing that outside angle across to the front of the pole and the inside angle is going to come across 
so the back side of the pole. So basically, the pole will be sandwiched between the angles. So that looks like this. Oh, the outside arm is going to come across as well because in the beginning you use both hands for spins. As you become more advanced, you can take just you do one arm spins, but we're not we're not ready for that just yet. So, fireman, extend, grab, sandwich the pole between the ankles, land on your feet. You can stay down here or you can bring it up. Oh, here we go. <laughs> you got this. You got this. She has this. Yes. Don't let her fool you. The things I do for my friends. Yes. I <laughs> love it. I, I love it. You, like you got it. There it is. There it is. <laughs> Woo! Like a pro. Like a pro. I did get the ass end up there. That was <laughs> really fun. good. I think that might have been even a little more polished than your husband. All right. So, yeah. Thank you so much. Oh, <laughs> nice. So guys, literally, I think I was doing that my first one. Like within 10 minutes. I can believe it. Yeah. yeah. And everyone, yeah. you know, kind of picks up at their own pace. And sure. that's a-okay. Yeah. You know, our instructors will work with you at whatever level you're at. So yeah. you did great. Thank she you. needs to come back, don't you all think? <laughs> so let's talk details. First okay. of all, you're on Weems Lane. Yes. 121 and Weems Lane in Pineville Plaza. And you will not miss the big Desmond Diva Fitness Sunday. I hope not. <laughs> Can't get my finger, guys. Look for it. You'll find right, it. Right. Um, but it's super private, which is really nice. You can see all the windows are blocked out, so you don't have to worry about anybody watching you from the outside. Correct. Um, it is usually just women. There's one class that men can come to. Well, actually, we have recently made a change to that, okay. and now all classes are open to everyone. So okay. everyone is welcome. Fabulous. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I love it. Yeah. So I'm trying to get my husband in, so. Can't wait to see that. We might need another video for, He's, for oh, that. We're definitely videoing that. I don't know if they'll let me share it, but we're videoing oh, yes, it. we are. We need to document that. Yes. I'll show you a video I just did of him. Yeah. I can't wait to he see was, that. He was shower head wrong, y'all. I'll tell that story. Oh. I'll tell that story on the podcast. Yes. Tune you, you're in. You're going to want to hear that, you, so. You want to hear Stay it. Stay tuned. Yes. He'll kill me, but he doesn't listen to us. Right. Business, so I'm right. He really does. He watches everything. That's okay. So you have packages. What do yes. people need to do to sign up? So we do all of our booking online, and that is at DazzlingDivaFitness.com. Should be super easy to remember. Uh, new students, meaning you've never taken classes with us, with us before, are eligible for our new student special. Three classes, beginner pole and or beginner lira, meaning you can do all three with pole. You can do all three with lira, which is the aerial hoop we talked about at the beginning. Or you can try both, which nice. is awesome. Yeah. 33 bucks. They're good for 30 days from the date of purchase. I mean, it's really like such a good deal. And Absolutely. I'm going to apologize in advance for telling you you're going to get hooked. So <laughs> just prepare to spend your money taking pole and Lyra classes because you're 13 or 14 fun. years later, you will be saying the same thing as me. Yeah. Which and is, guys, I'm going to give away a package for someone new to start. Ooh. So share the video, you yes. guys. current students Absolutely. or maybe um, if you've been a student with us before and you had to you know step away for a period of time yeah. because life we all get it um, but you know maybe you could rejoin us if things have changed you know we, we do have we have a lot of regulars of course and then we have people who kind of you know, just float in and out as their life and schedule allows so and Mine we're always travel right exactly <laughs> exactly it's amazing when you do so share that please check them out online and listen to the podcast get more details and learn a little more about Melissa. Looking for yes. her husband. Yes, yes. <laughs> well, uh, Missy, thank you for uh, giving Dazzling Diva Fitness the opportunity to be featured in your video. We are very appreciative of that. Thank you so much. My pleasure. And uh, if I haven't met you yet, I look Our forward to seeing you in class soon. <laughs>